What's up, Nick Kids? It's your boy Nickelodeon, and today I am going to be showing you guys my poster wall. Now, this is a Welcome to Bikini Bottom poster. Not very rare, nothing really special about it. I just like it because it has all the characters from Bikini, well, not all of them, but a lot of the characters from Bikini Bottom. I actually did a puzzle like this. It was 3,000 pieces, took me forever, but I had fun doing it. I want to move on to my next picture. This is a picture of the wild Thornberry signed by the voice of Eliza Thornberry, a.k.a. Lacey Chabber, if I'm not mistaken. Moving along, we have an autographed framed picture of Chelsea Brummett. If you don't know who's Chelsea Brummett, she's from All That, some of the later seasons. She was hilarious and a great addition to the cast. Here we have, this one's very special to me. But it is a Rugrats book signed by Melanie Didi Chardoff, the voice of Didi. She's actually from New Haven like I am. So I reached out to her uh, when she dropped her new book, Melanie Chardoff's Odd Woman Out, which is an amazing read. This Didi is not the Didi she is in real life. Read that book and you will see. But anyway, she actually autographed both books for me and I was extremely grateful. Moving along, we have this Comic-Con International San Diego 2016 exclusive poster. Not only is the poster exclusive, but it's autographed by Arlene Klasky, half of Klasky Supo, who makes the Rugrats, Ariel Monsters, bunch of other stuff. It's also signed by Butch Hartman, who's the creator of The Fairly Odd Parents and Danny Phantom. It's also signed by Jody V, who created Zim. And next to Zim is this autograph that says, Hey Steve. Now, I'm not Steve, but I bought this poster from a Steve. And it's signed by Craig Bartlett. If you can guess who he created, you win nothing because it's right there. But the creator of Hey Arnold. Moving along, I have this poster, which is just a bunch of random Nickelodeon characters. It's not autographed by anyone. It came from Five Below. And, uh... I just really, really like it, and I thought it looked great in my living room. But under that poster, we have the All That Signed Autographed Logo. Now, this thing is signed by Danny Tamborelli, Lori Beth Denberg, Josh Server, and, oh, I'm sorry, two ends, Cal Mitchell, and Angelique Bates, the lovely Angelique Bates, who I consider a friend of mine. She is an amazing person. She signed this for me after they all did, and I am grateful for it. Then there's this one. Clarissa explains it all. Now, allow me to explain who autographed this poster. Melissa Joan Hart, the star of Clarissa Explains It All, and I love this picture. Then we have Hey Arnold, the movie. Now, this poster isn't signed, but it will be signed at some point. I'm going to send it off to uh, somebody who agreed to sign. I'm not going to say their name yet. This is not signed by anyone, neither is it a poster, but there's a cool story behind this, maybe not cool to you guys, but my girlfriend spent hours upon hours upon hours playing this Spongebob game at Chuck E. Cheese, and we won every card in the set. We actually won multiples of every card in the set, so we decided to frame it. Moving along, Angelique Bates again, and look at her from the Randy and Mandy chocolate uh, skits. How beautiful, so young. Oh, Angelique, I hope you watch this. Up here, we have a Wild Thornberries poster. Now, again, this isn't signed by anyone, but hopefully I spoke to Tom Kane, who was the voice of Darwin, and he said he'll send me an autograph, which I'm very excited to receive. Then there's this, which says, Good day and love, Der Debbie Derryberry, the voice of Jimmy Neutron. Now, I do have the autographs from his father, Hugh, too, but I haven't framed it. I haven't figured out how I'm going to do that. And finally, the holy grail of my posters and autographs. This poster is a movie poster, so it's bigger than all the other posters. And it is autographed. So here we have the late, great Rest in peace to Christine Cavanaugh, who voiced Chucky in the original series before it was taken over by Nancy Cartwright. Then moving down, we have E.G. Daly, who's the voice of Tommy Pickles. Oh, I love her. I watch her TikTok and Instagram daily. And then there's Dale, signed by, uh, huh, 
It's not who I thought it was. I thought it was Tori Strong. You know what? I believe her name back then was a different name, but I think that is Tori Strong. It's definitely Tori. Moving along, we have Cheryl Chase, the voice of Angelica. Oh, she's so much fun. She still does all types of content online, and I love watching her. We have Kath Sousey, who's the voice of Phil and Lil, and their mother, Betty. Then we have this one. Where is it? Arlene Klasky. Now, that is half of Klasky Chupo, and I already have her autograph on that other poster, but... I wanted to have it up here too. And we have Gobber Supo, who's the other half of uh, Klasky Chupo. And we have Mark Mothersball, who makes the noises like beep bop bop bop. And we have, at, uh, what's his name? What's his name? Uh, it's killing me. Albie Hat. He is the executive producer of the movie. And Norton Virgine, who is the, uh, I want to say director? Yes, the director of the movie. And last is my. Cell art. This is a actual frame from the movie, hand painted, signed by Arlene Klasky and Gobber Chupo. That makes three times that I have Klasky's autograph and two times that I have Chupo. But when I saw this, I just couldn't pass it up. This was two hundred dollars. This was two hundred dollars. Overall, I have like a thousand dollar poster collection. But I love it. And if you love it too, then do me a favor, leave a like, a thumbs up, and comment your favorite poster. Everyone who leaves a comment will be entered into a random giveaway. I will pick a name and give you something for free. Alright? Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy.